What does this mean? It means the cup is not sitting up against the face of the bottom bracket shell because the threads that it's threaded into are not perpendicular to the face of the shell. And why does this matter? It's because of the bearings, okay? You need to have the bearings in perfect alignment or they won't spin smoothly. That's number one, all right? Because the bearings themselves have an internal tolerance. There's about a two thousandths of an inch internal tolerance inside of this bearing. And if I'm pushing it out four thousandths of an inch on one side, heaven knows what's on the other side. I haven't even checked that one yet. You're basically, the bearings are now gonna be sitting in there all <laughs> wompy, right? So when you try to push the spindle through, it's gonna try to force them into alignment. And now the bearings are gonna have an internal constriction. They are going to be forced up against themselves and they're not gonna spin smoothly. Like I said, that's number one. Number two, as we're threading this cup in, when we're putting that 40 Newton meters, which is a lot of force on that cup, it's actually going to twist the outer cup flange up against the frame. And you're not gonna be able to slide a feeler gauge under there because it's actually put the aluminum piece into a bind and those stress risers get introduced into the bearing, putting yet another level of constriction and restriction on the bearing itself. So it's never going to spin smoothly and you're going to have rapid wear as the parts are forced up against each other and they're rotating. And that's why, check out BB Infinite. The link is in our bio. We're gonna face this frame and we'll show you a facing in an upcoming video.